we're here tonight because the New York League of Conservation Voters is inside having a uh, $15,000 a table dinner this evening. Uh, where they're going to have a whole host of different uh, guests at their fundraiser. And the problem is that they're taking money from many, many gas companies, including Chesapeake, including uh, Spectra, including Williams, along with many, many others. Meanwhile, uh, they're supposed to be environmental protectors. But what we know is that fracking is not safe. Fracking is not good for the environment. So we're here in opposition to the New York League of Conservation Voters taking money from fossil fuel industry and not looking out for their primary purpose, which is to protect the environment. Here we are, the League of Conservation Voters. Anybody want to put a conservation word out against fracking? Want to take a stand? Take a stand. Come on, take a stand. So we'd like to do a survey right now. How many people here are against fracking and how many people are for fracking? Against fracking. Who's against fracking here? We get a show of hands. We're really interested. We're not here to mock you. We're here to actually try to, you know, change things. You're against fracking. We have one. One person against fracking? Hi, what's going on there? Well, I don't know. It's this great party, and somehow it's a party by environmentalists for environmentalists, but I'm not so sure because, you know, their biggest donors are Chesapeake and Spectre Energy and, you know, the mayor's girlfriend and all these people that are really working to, to, you know, promote frack gas and, and to bring pipelines into Manhattan. I'm just trying to make sense of this, that, that this League of Conservation Voters is fully funded and soaked in fossil fuel interests. I mean, just, I, I don't get it. So, <clears throat> how many people know about the Spectra Pipeline here? Does anybody want to stop the Spectra Pipeline? Are you in favor of the Spectra Pipeline? Who's in favor of the Spectra Pipeline? Well, since nobody wants to talk to me, uh, I'm going to say goodnight to you all. Thank you all for listening. I hope you learned something tonight. I hope that you'll wonder next time if you're a conservationist for philosophical reasons or if you're a conservation... You can't hear me? Oh, thank you. We have an environmentalist. We have an environmentalist, ladies and gentlemen.